Hi everyone and welcome to the video series for My Life with Food Allergies. I'm Lauren from Oatmeal with a Fork and today I'm going to show you how to make your very own homemade salad dressing. This lemon oregano vinaigrette is one that I use practically weekly with my salads. So let's get started and I'll show you what ingredients you need. Lemon juice obviously is the main ingredient here along with some olive oil, salt and pepper. I also have some garlic powder, onion powder, dried oregano, uh, some Dijon mustard, and a little maple syrup for a touch of sweetness. And what I've been doing here is I've been juicing my lemons. You need about three to four lemons for a total of half a cup of lemon juice. And then just to get all of the seeds out, I use a little strainer. And for the first step, I actually pour everything into a measuring cup. And then this helps me um, so that I don't have to dirty uh, individual measuring cups and this is just the way I like to do it. So here we have a half a cup of lemon juice and to the lemon juice we're going to add three quarters of a cup of olive oil. I'm just going to add it right in there so half a cup plus three quarters of a cup is one and a quarter cup. So when it gets to that point you know you're done. And then we're also going to add in a quarter teaspoon of powdered garlic powder, a half teaspoon of onion powder, and a tablespoon of Dijon mustard, we're also going to do a half teaspoon of sea salt and two teaspoons of dried oregano. And then just for a little touch of sweetness, it just cuts the acidity of the lemon juice. One teaspoon of maple syrup. And then my personal preference is to add in quite a bit of black pepper, but you can decide that that ingredient, you know, you can tailor that to your preference. Just like that. Once everything is scraped into your little pitcher, you just want to pour it. I have a mason jar here. You can use, you know, whatever sealed jar you have at home. Just dump it right all in there. And I like this dressing too because it doesn't require the use of any equipment. No food processor, no blender to get dirty, to clean, gosh. And then you just pour everything in here, shake it up till it's nice and emulsified. And then here I have a typical salad for me, a um, couple of different kinds of lettuce, some arugula, um, red bell pepper, broccoli sprouts. Um, and I have some of my toppings here just to show you some uh, some shredded grated carrot, um, pumpkin seeds. I like something crunchy. I put raisins in there for something sweet. Sometimes I add some goat cheese for something kind of tangy. And then just a few tablespoons of this right on top and you're good to go. No preservatives to worry about. Um, allergy friendly, however you want to make it. Um, and I hope you guys enjoyed this recipe and I'll see you next time. Bye.